The Philippines is expected to acquire the multirole fighters this year which will be one of the prestige projects of the president. The multirole fighters are included in the procurement monitoring report of the DND. And we might hear some good news about this within the coming weeks. Once these multirole fighters are acquired, the Philippine Air Force, with the help of these radar systems, can be deployed to determine whether the aircraft flying over the country's airspace is friendly or hostile. With the help of the multirole fighters and the GBADS, this will greatly boost our country's air defense capabilities. The GBADS is also the Philippine Air Force's secondary air defense cover after manned fighter aircraft, with the role currently being undertaken by the Air Force's FA-50PH fleet. The Swedish-made Gripen is a single-engine multirole fighter capable of speeds up to Mach 2.0. It is armed with a 20mm automatic cannon and is capable of carrying a variety of rockets, bombs, missiles, and surveillance equipment. It would be remembered that President Marcos Jr. said that he will build a modern air force and will buy state-of-the-art multirole fighter aircraft to boost the air defense capabilities of the Philippines Air Force. In an interview with the media with the Commander-in-Chief, President Ferdinand R. Marcos Jr. on March 8, 2023, he shared his experience in boarding an FA-50PH fighter jet where he saw the necessity to increase the capability of the military to defend the country's territory. We saw some of the capabilities that were demonstrated to me during the flight and we can see how important this increase in our capabilities is going to be, especially in the defense of our maritime territory.